One of the youngest individuals facing charges tied to the insurrection at the U.S. Capitol has now learned that he will spend more than two years behind bars. Cliff Mackerel from Wellington was just sentenced to 27 months in prison. Mackerel was just 19 years old when he and his father traveled to D.C. in support of former President Donald Trump's Stop the Steal rally. News 5 reporter Clay Park continues our coverage of the Northeast Ohio people who face charges connected to that day. In this crowd of people outside the U.S. Capitol on January 6, 2021, prosecutors say then 19-year-old Cliff Mackerel pushed barricades and repeatedly hit a U.S. Capitol police officer, even grabbing the officer's mask. That same day, Mackerel had posted on Facebook saying the government was corrupt and, quote, how about we get rid of all of them because it's our literal job as Americans to kill the tyrannical government. Court paperwork details how Cliff and his father, Michael Mackerel, traveled from Northeast Ohio to Washington, D.C. to attend the Stop the Steal rally, even buying gas masks along the way. Cliff Mackerel and his father each pled guilty to one count of assaulting, resisting, or impeding certain officers. The now 23-year-old is just one of more than 50 people from Ohio who have been charged or convicted in connection to that day, a day where many woke up early and traveled from Northeast Ohio and took part in an insurrection at the U.S. Capitol. If you don't fight like hell, you're not going to have a country anymore. In a letter to the judge, Clifford Mackerel wrote, quote, I am filled with remorse and regret causing harm to law enforcement officers, adding, please know that I am deeply ashamed of my actions and am committed to learning from this experience and making better choices in the future. Cliff's father, Michael Mackerel, is scheduled to be sentenced later this month. There are still hundreds of unidentified individuals captured in photos and videos from January 6th. You can view them on the FBI's website. In downtown Cleveland, Clay Lepard, News 5. And according to the De Department of Justice, more than 50 people in Ohio have been arrested so far in connection to the insurrection on January the 6th. A lot of these arrests came from anonymous tips, and there are still hundreds of unidentified people captured in photos and also video from that day. As Clay said, we have a link to all those videos with this article on our website, news5cleveland.com, also on our News 5 app.